Hey everyone, in this video we will see uh, how to write the behavioral description that is behavioral code for 2 to 4 decoder in VHDL using case statements. So first we will see the truth table for 2 to 4 decoder. So a decoder is something which converts a uh, few data to many data. So 2 bits are converted to 4 bits here. So like this we will be having 4 to 16, 3 to 8. Uh, so uh, different types of decoders are there. So in particular we are discussing about 2 to 4 decoder. So it will be having 2 inputs as its uh, in, uh, in incoming data and it will be giving a 4 bits output data. So as you can see for 0 0 the output is 0 0 0 1. That means for if the input data A1 and A0 are 0 0 the output bit B0 will be high because when you convert this 0 0 to decimal it will be 0 and this 0 is high here and if it is 0 1 then 1th bit will be high that is here and if it is 1 0 this is uh, 2 in decimal so 2nd bit will be high and if it is 1 1 that is 3 and 3rd bit will be high and others will be 0. So like this in a simple way uh, the 2 to 4 decoder is working. So how I can implement it with the help of this Xilinx model sim code or very uh, behavioral code we will see. So if you are new to the channel please guys hit the like button and subscribe the channel and don't forget to check our playlist we have uploaded a n number of videos there so you can learn ABCD of this uh, uh, behavioral and very log coding for this Xilinx model sim. So I hope you like this playlist so thank you for visiting the channel. Okay so coming to the uh, today's topic so uh, first we will start with uh, defining the entity so entity decoder is so decoder is the user defined name here so you can give of your choice so i have given it as decoder then uh, define the input and output ports here so port a in standard logic vector 1 down to 0 so i have a1 and a0 so i will be defining it in terms of the vector so a of 1 and a of 0 are the two variables which are provided with uh, this line then b is also defined with the uh, a vector format that is b colon out standard logic vector 3 down to 0 so this will give b of 3 b of 2 b of 1 and b of 0 then close this port bracket that is this second one and put a semicolon and then end this decoder so end this decoder entity here then once you define the entity then call that entity so structure architecture behavioral of decoder is so here you should be calling with the same name what you have defined so if you change this name then it will throw an error saying that the entity is not defined or the variable is not defined so make sure that you are using the same name then a begin for this behavioral module then process the input so input is a here so process a then begin for this process then case a is so we'll be using the case statements for comparison so case a means uh, a value will be replaced with these values whenever it is comparing so when a is 0 0 so it will be reading like when a is 0 0 then that implies assign b with the value of 0 0 0 1 so this is how we can read these statements when a is 0 0 assign b with value 0 0 0 1 so this statement we are implementing first when a is 0 0 assign b as 0 0 0 1 and when 0 1 that is when a is 0 1 so an a is 0 1 assign b as 0 0 1 0 and when a is 1 0 assign b as 0 1 double 0 and when a is 1 1 at that moment assign b as g 1 0 0 0 that is last condition so we will write the whole truth table in terms of the case statements then when others that is the default condition assign b as 0 0 0 so if anything else other than this condition happens at that time assign b as 0 0 0 that means the no output will be produced so 0 will be the output at that moment uh, we will be writing this statement and then end this case statement and end this process and end the behavioral so as you can see for this case uh, this is the end and for this process this is the end and for this begin this is the end so as i said earlier in vhdl or very low coding we will be having as many as closing doors as we keep on opening so these these three doors we have opened then these three doors we need to close also 
so like this with the help of case statements and the simple truth table we will be writing the code that is verilog vhdl code for the 2 to 4 decoder so i hope you like this video please guys if you are new to the channel hit the like button and subscribe the channel for more updates thank you thanks for watching